I am Father Dion, the post-Catholic chaplain of the Headquarters and Headquarters Support Group, Philippine Army. And this is Salita ng Dios, ang ating gabay. Today is Wednesday of the 24th week in Ordinary Time, and from the Holy Gospel according to St. Luke, Glory to you, O Lord. Jesus said to all, If anyone wishes to come after me, he must deny himself and take up his cross daily and follow me. For whoever wishes to save his life will lose it, but whoever loses his life for my sake will save it. What profit is there for one to gain the whole world, yet lose or forfeit himself? Whoever is ashamed of me and of my words, the Son of Man will be ashamed of when He comes in His glory and in the glory of the Father and of the holy angels. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. My dear brothers and sisters in the military and uniform services, Jesus in today's Gospel said, If anyone would come after me, let him deny himself, take up his cross daily, and follow me. For whoever would save his life will lose it, but whoever loses his life for my sake will save it. For what does it profit a man if he gains the whole world and loses or forfeit himself? For whoever is ashamed of me and my words, of him will the Son of Man be ashamed when he comes in his glory and the glory of the Father and of the holy angels. These words are a call to radical discipleship even in the context of military service. They remind us that our ultimate allegiance is not to any earthly power or authority, but to Jesus Christ. Jesus asked us to deny ourselves. In the military, self-denial is not unfamiliar or strange to you. It requires discipline, sacrifice, and putting the needs of others before your own. It means embracing the values of honor, courage, and selflessness in the face of danger or adversity. As you serve, let your actions reflect the character of Christ, showing love, compassion, and integrity in all you do. Jesus calls us to take up our cross daily. In the military, you understand the weight of carrying a burden. It may involve physical, emotional, or mental challenges that can be overwhelming at times. But remember, Jesus carried His cross willingly, enduring immense suffering for the sake of others. In your service, you too can find strength and purpose in carrying your cross, knowing that your sacrifice contributes to the greater good and the protection of those in need. Jesus reminds us that gaining the whole world is meaningless if we lose ourselves. In the pursuit of the military objectives, it's essential to stay rooted in the principles and values that define who you are. The world may offer fleeting fame, power, or recognition, but true fulfillment and purpose are found in aligning your life with the teachings of Christ. Finally, Jesus warns against being ashamed of Him and His words. In the military, there may be times when faith is challenged or ridiculed. Yet, Jesus encourages us to stand firm in our conviction, unashamedly proclaiming His truth and embodying His love. Let your faith be a source of strength, guiding your actions with integrity and compassion, even in the most difficult circumstances. As you go forth in your service, may you find inspiration and courage in the words of Jesus, may they remind you that your calling as a servant of justice and peace is inseparable from your calling as a follower of Christ. May your lives be testimonies of sacrificial love, honor, and unwavering faith. May God bless each one of you and keep you safe in His loving care as you carry out your vital duties. Amen. And this is Salita ng Dios. Ang ating gabay. Let us pray. Gracious and Almighty God, in the midst of the challenges and battles we face as soldiers, 
We humbly come before you in prayer. Help us to heed the words of your Son, Jesus, as recorded in today's Gospel. Lord, grant us the strength to deny ourselves, to put aside our own desires and ambitions, and to humbly follow you. Help us to take up our cross daily, willingly embracing the sacrifices and hardships that come with our service. Grant us the wisdom to understand that true life and salvation are found in losing ourselves for your sake. Protect us from the allure of worldly gain and recognition. Help us to remember that gaining the whole world means nothing if we lose ourselves in the process. Keep us anchored in your truth and remind us of the eternal significance of our actions. Lord, we pray that we may never be ashamed of you and your words. Give us the courage to stand firm in our faith even in the face of adversity or opposition. May our lives bear witness to your love, mercy, and grace as we serve with honor, integrity, and compassion. Bless and protect us, Lord, as we carry out our duties. Strengthen us in times of weakness, guide us in times of confusion, and grant us peace in times of turmoil. Surround us with your divine presence as we strive to make a positive difference in the world. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. And may the Almighty God bless you and your family, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen.